Welcome to the Europol Review for 2012, a publication that charts the progress that Europol is making in helping member states to fight organised crime and terrorism in Europe. We are doing this by using our unique capabilities, firstly as an information centre in Europe to make sure that there is a safe and secure and rapid exchange of intelligence and police information between the law enforcement authorities of Europe. Acting as an operational support centre in thousands of cases a year in the investigation of the most dangerous criminal and terrorist networks and operating as a centre of expertise in the fight against crime and terrorism. 2012 saw in particular the establishment of the new European Cybercrime Centre at Europol, an innovative new creation, an innovative new capability to fight one of the most damaging forms of organised crime that society faces today. During the year, Europol also provided other forms of support to the member states. We made a, a contribution to the safety of large international events such as the London Olympics, the European Football Championships in Poland and Ukraine, and in other areas as well. Internally, to make sure that Europol is fit for purpose in helping the member states and provide the optimum operational service, we carried out a major reorganisation at a time of budget austerity, at a time of rising workloads. We have cut our management posts, we have slashed our administrative processes and made the organisation much more efficient. So 20, 2012 has been a really challenging year for Europol, but we are modernising ourselves very quickly to make sure that we will stay at the heart of the European Union's attempts to fight organised crime and terrorism.